get ready with us we are in texas i'm visiting my family in texas and we are going shopping i'm here with my sister-in-law and we're gonna do our makeup together i'm so excited so let's get into it we are going to highland park village and we're going to do a little shopping oh my god last night we went out and one of my heels got stuck like on the floor thing when we were out at the rooftop bar and my heel broke so that's an excuse to buy some new shoes i'm gonna use this moisturizer from peach and lily this, they sent me this moisturizer and i'm so excited i've been using it and i i really like it I like the color of this i'm so excited because i haven't been to texas in like a year and i try to come visit at least once a year and it's so hot right now it's literally like 78 or something all right, let's put this moisturizer on. I really like how it feels. So good. Brought all my makeup, I put it in here, and I like had to stuff it because I brought so much. First things first, sunscreen. I still love the sunscreen, it's so good. Oh, I love my Kiehl sunscreen, but we'll use this one. Sunscreen all the time. We had so much fun last night, but I will literally get home so late from the bar place it was a rooftop it was really nice oh my god some dudes started dancing and it was hilarious like we took some videos <laughs> foundation and i've been mixing these two because i'm in between my winter and my summer color so oh yes and we're doing our makeup together it's so much fun so i just mix it I really, every time I come here, I always want to go to um, Top Golf. I freaking love Top Golf. Like, you will think that I'm like a golfie because I just love going there. I just love the vibe at Top Golf. It's so much fun. I got a huge pimple right here. I've been trying to cover up. Oh my God, my flight was so crazy yesterday. And I got delayed and then they bumped me up to the next flight. And then after that, I'm like, you know what? I'm going to try to go to the gate. And I made it to the gate. And I was like, still put me on this flight. Put me back on my own flight. And then I got on the flight. And the flight was like empty and I got the whole row. I was so comfy. And then I was listening to um that Tana Man Manjo. Tana Manjo. How do you say her name? Tana Manjo. I was listening to her podcast. And it was so good because it was Jelly Roll and his wife were on the podcast. And oh my god, they are so cute. So I was really loving that that episode. I didn't finish the whole episode, but I was listening to it and it was really good. And then I was listening to Girls Next Level, the podcast and the most recent one they had like a most requested guest on there and it was so good and then i just put a lot here right here put it here a pimple here and then i've been using this white one a little bit of this white one because my under eye circles are crazy and I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad. We're doing like a step by step makeup. And then I'm just going to use face powder. This is, I think, the Wet n Wild face powder. And then I just put this face powder all over my face, like everywhere. This is just to like set my entire face. Put it everywhere. Dark. Put my brows. I never do my brows on camera. So, you never do my brows. This powder. Like I just put it under here, the yellow. Yeah. My niece is so beautiful. Oh, Auntie loves you. Oh, Auntie loves you. Auntie loves you. Yes. Don't feel the straw. So the podcast that I was listening to with Jelly Roll. Oh my God. They are like the sweetest and the cutest couple ever. And oh my god, I like had no idea about the relationship. They've been together for so long and they're so cute. And I just started listening to Jelly Roll's music and I'm really getting into country and I really like his music. And he does, he says that after every like concert, I think he was saying something like that, he tries to like, if he has like different shows in an area, he tries to like stay around and like do something for the community. I forgot exactly what he said, but I was like, oh, that's so cool. That's that's awesome that you know he's also like cares about the community and stuff like that so that's awesome and his wife is so so sweet and i just love that they were talking about like imposter syndrome and all that stuff like 
And I feel like a lot of people deal with imposter syndrome and it's pretty much when you like, your brain tries to tell you like, oh, are you, you don't really deserve this or like, you, everybody's gonna found, find out that you're not that great and they were talking about that and they themselves like tana was saying that she has gets imposter syndrome and they themselves and i guess that's something that like doesn't go away i guess that's something that like everybody fights with imposter syndrome but you gotta believe that you're there because you made it there because you're ready to be there because you deserve it because you worked hard you gotta tell yourself that you just because it seems easy or just because it comes easy to you that doesn't mean that you didn't work hard for it in your own way so always remind yourself that like you worked hard for this you worked hard for this so that was really cool i really like that they were talking about imposter syndrome on the podcast that was really cool i go to highland park village and i'm thinking i really want to see if we can stop at chanel and see what they have <laughs> So let's, we'll stop at Chanel. And I don't know what other stores they have. Do they have, uh, I think they have a Fendi. So maybe we'll stop a Fendi. That'd be good. Um, and then we'll probably grab some lunch. And that should be fun. And walk around because the weather is amazing. Right? Look at my lashes. Okay, this book is so good. It's on my Amazon storefront, but I got her the same book for Christmas and it's so good. It just, it brings everything you need. I love it. I'm most of the time doing her lashes. My sister-in-law, because she's here in the bathroom maybe. So finishing up, I just have this lip liner. It's like a mauve color. And then I have this nude lipstick and I'm just popping this on. Now we're in a rush. Oh, he's in a rush. And nude lipstick, mauve color liner. And I'm gonna put a little lip gloss on top. I have your lip oil. Just like a drop. Just a drop. Just a drop. We're done. Oh, I gotta blend my nose a little bit. All right. Oh, oh. And that's the look, and we're out the door. This is the final look. I just did her makeup. It looks so good. All right, we're out. Alright, we are out. We're going shopping. Well, look how beautiful she looks. Ah! Bye! Spend a day with me in Dallas. We went to Highland Park and we did a little shopping. Oh my god, look at this adorable poodle. Reminds me of my dog. So first we went to Love Shack Fancy and we did a little shopping. Everything is so beautiful and pink and spring and ruffles and feminine. This store is gorge, gorge, gorge. Uh, shop till you drop and of course build up an appetite to get a little lunch after i am obsessed with everything ruffle and feminine and the colors in the store everything is so so beautiful and girly and feminine i love it this right here this is art i just love how cute and feminine everything is it's so pretty honestly the skirts are everything and the whole gang's here my whole family's here so we're all just enjoying a beautiful day beautiful weather i'm like what am i looking at here and i'm looking at the little bracelets but they're all blue there's no pink ones look at my knees isn't she adorable <laughs> so then we decided to grab a little lunch. We grabbed a little lunch. I think this is called Mi Cocina and I'm trying to beat the big back allegation. So I got a salad and my brother got whatever this is. And I had a frozen margarita. Then obviously we went somewhere else. I don't know what this area is called. I totally forgot. But we made a stop of Lululemon. And one of the girls that was working there gave me the biggest compliment while I walked in. And I was like, okay, now i gotta now i gotta shop because the compliment like literally made my day so look at this skirt it's so 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 adorable she's like oh my god you look like a celebrity like when i saw you from outside you ate and that was enough for me to make a purchase yes it was so i was looking at the pink 
the fine jackets again and i don't know what this jacket it looks reddish but it's supposed to be pink she said it's pink so i was like okay you're 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 coming home with me you're you're coming home with me so i definitely got the jacket and she slayed let's let's go let's go i am obsessed with the little skirts right now they are so so cute so then we decided to walk around a little bit more and then we stopped at this spot and i decided i was like you know what oh we stopped in this place to use the bathroom and the bathroom is like gorge 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 so here i am with my brother and we're doing a little we're doing a little stroll we're doing a little stroll down the road uh lululemon secured and then i had like a beer i was trying to be um different go with the flow and try a little beer and after that cheers love my brother and then after that we decided to go to the ford um stadium area and there's like a really cool like bar place there so we decided to hang out there for a little while and have a few drinks and just enjoy the music because the music was bumping here it was bumping and you know wearing my sunglasses inside because late and yeah that was the day so much fun